I've had jobs where I've not bothered to come out and no one notices or nobody cares. And for instance, a security gig that I did where I just knew everybody would have been really immature about it. You just could tell I was just guy only. And I didn't bother to tell anybody and nobody asked because I think they were kind of not intelligent enough to realize it or if they were, they knew not to bring it up. Just kind of not the environment to talk about it, security stuff. And I've had other jobs like my in and out burger job, for instance, that's considered a Christian company. So I had guys mess with me there in stupid ways. <laughs> but I think that we all kind of knew that it was a place where you can't really talk about it. You can't really work for a Christian company, even if it is a restaurant, and then wave a rainbow, rainbow flag around and say that you're gay. It doesn't really work. You know, you. I just had to keep that on the DL a little bit. But I did have people messing with me and make jokes at me a little bit, and it was funny. But And as for the other thing, you said that the guy, I guess you've had people say, oh, that girl's hot. Yeah, I've had a guy once invite me to a security, what, there was a security guy that invited me over to a strip bar, and he just wanted to mess with me and get me to admit that I wasn't. And the common question that I've gotten is if I have a girlfriend, and they want me to say, no, I don't have a girlfriend, I'm gay, or... <laughs> try to get you to admit it or, or just see how you react or squirm and, and just develop suspicions and try to confirm them somehow in a way that they think is sly but it's not really that sly you really shouldn't be doing that anyway <laughs> and if they needed to they should at least know you first but these guys did not know me very well but yeah I think that coworkers are they're not always people that we're very personal with like we can be in a way but we also cannot be in a way and you know, you can be friendly with people, but not exactly personal or deep with people. And in my experience with coworkers, is they're sort of just there. They might be fun, they might be cool, and, and you might have conversations with them, but I never felt close to my coworkers at all. I never really had that. There were more, some coworkers that I liked more than others, depending on the job, and might have fun talking to them, but I never really felt the need to get that personal with them. I just think that at work we should be talking about work and, and be professional and, and make small talk, but personal talk can be done outside of work if we felt so inclined to hang out outside of work and that either never happened or happened very little because it's not not the place where I really want to pick up friends. I don't think we need to tell coworkers at all. I've known gay guys that have told me that they've now never told any of their coworkers and they might work at the same place ten or twenty or more years, but it just isn't necessary and they don't want to talk about it and by then I imagine they all probably know to some level but if it's never been something that's been welcomed into conversation then it's not something that they ever really felt like asking about but and a lot of times with the gay guys that are a little more obvious they just kind of know and they show that with the ways that they say things or don't say things or I mean they, they don't really need to ask because they already know but that doesn't mean that they they really talk about it either. Anyway, I never felt the need to tell any coworkers ever, really. And I know I'm not the only gay person that felt that way. <laughs>